Welcome back to Booster Therapy, your cure for that pack cracking addiction. Today we have a box of Rivals of Ixalan. Bust this bad boy open and see if we can pull some cool stuff out of it. Definitely some fun mythics and rares out of this set that kind of surprised people a little bit after the fact in terms of its value. So we'll see if we can get lucky. Maybe get a rekindling, a mortal sun, uh, some other fun stuff that's in here as well. So hopefully we can pull something pretty cool and go from there. So let's take a look. All right, uh, I don't think there's anything really in the, certainly not in the common section. There might be some stuff here in the uncommon area. Let's clear this box away over here. All right, Jungle Creeper, Sadistic Sky Marcher, Dire Fleet. The hell is that? Oh, right away. That is a very nice card. Azor's Gateway. This is one of those cards that uh, definitely crept up in value because it has a pretty nasty little flip ability there, Sanctum of the Sun. So that's pretty awesome. Get the gateway out of the way early. All right, great start. Let's see if we can follow it up with a nice little rekindling phoenix. That would be sweet. All right, Fall Orchard. Rushing Brontodon, Raging Regasaur. Oh, sweet! It's another cool one. The Primal Tide. Wondering if uh, I know it sees a little bit of play. I'm wondering if we'll see some more play, depending on what we see out of the next set with uh, counter spells and all that junk that I'm sure will be coming back around. Kind of help deal with some of the control aspects of the game. All right, next one. There we are. Riverwise Augur, Daring Buccaneer, Golden Demise, and a Dire Fleet Daredevil. Another good card. Really had some good luck here so far with the old Rivals box. Yeah, I'm guessing, depending, by the time this gets posted, it'll probably be sometime in December, so happy December to you, and Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, Happy Kwanzaa, Happy Atheist, whatever you may be celebrating or not celebrating, let it be happy and joyful. Oh, Mamma mia, <laughs> just like the Immortal spicy Sun, meatball. this box has been kick arse so far. Mortal Sun. Dang. That is a great, great start to this box. I honestly, I don't think I could ask for anything better. Within reason. I mean, two really great hits so far. This is really sweet. Let's see if we can get some... Is Jade Light in this set? I think it is. We can get a Jade Light here. I think it's just a regular, regular rare, so... Alright, Brass is Bounty. And a foil. Forest. Alright. Next guy on up. On the list. And if you're still watching at this point, if you're not a subscriber, uh, we really appreciate it if you could give us a subscribe. Ring that bell. It'll let you know when we have new videos coming up. And uh, hit that like button as well. That will... Uh, also help us get the content to some other folks who maybe haven't seen us before and join the Booster Therapy family. So, appreciate that if you've done that or if you're planning to. Baffling End and a Talani Summoner. I don't know this card that well. Ooh, and a Foil. Pitiless Plunderer. Plunderer. Rrr, rrr. All right, rivals, you've been very generous thus far to keep my hopes and dreams alive. Look at that. 
join the closed beta. Not anymore, Buster. That's old news. Another very played card with White Weenie. Sky Marcher, Enter the Unknown. Another Baffling End. And another Mythic. Houtley, Radiant Champion. Houtley? Houtley? This is one that I have really not seen get much of any play. I'm not sure if it will or could. Let's see, what does it do here? Put a loyalty counter on it for each creature you control. So that could do something there. Target creature gets plus X plus X down a turn. X is the number of creatures you control. Or you get an emblem. Whenever a creature enters the battlefield under your control, you may draw a card. Okay. Something. And a foil dinosaur hunter. All right, we are three mythics strong so far. This is uh, kind of a ridiculous start. It'd be a real shame if they doubled up on mythics too. It'd be a real shame. I'm just saying. As good as this is going, I might as well sprinkle in a, a jade light. Assuming I'm thinking right, I think it's in the set. Get out of here. Uh, Hadana's Climb. And that baby flips into the winged temple of Areska. Areska's sweet. Areska's just kind of a cool idea. If you want to make anything, expand that into more of a story. Turn it into a little movie of some sort. Areska's kind of a cool one to do that with. If you're a big fat giant nerd. But hey, why not? Speaking of another card that's getting played a lot, Mono Blue Temple. Tempo, rather. Curious Obsession. There's another Adept. There's another one getting a lot of play. Ravenous Chupacabra. And Dead Man's Chest. Not getting play, but kind of a fun name. Alright. Negate. Reckless Rage, Forsaken Sanctuary, Stormfleet Sprinter, and a Dire Fleet Poisoner. Let's see what this one holds. Hopefully a nice little rekindling phoenix. Another Negate. Alright, mostly I'm a Harpy. What a recollection, recollection. Hello. Needle Tooth Raptor and a Temple Ultasaur. Source would deal damage to another dinosaur you control. Prevent all but one of that damage. Kind of a weird card. A little bit mana, mana pricey. But I mean, come on, dinosaurs are fun. Who doesn't like dinosaurs? Another Harpy, Ravenous Chupacabra. Uh, let's see here, uh, Cacophodon? I don't know, maybe. And a Seafloor Oracle. The Oracle. All right, we're on to the next stack here, ladies and germs. And we shall see what we get. Evolving Wilds, Pitiless Plunderer again. Resplendent Griffin. Another Silver Gill Adept. And the Sphinx's Decree. Opponent can't cast instant or sorcerer spells during that player's next turn. And again, kind of a weird card. I don't know that I've ever seen that get any play. Too specific, too bizarre. How bizarre. How bizarre. Alright, uh, Imperial Ceratops. Pride of the Conquerors. Oatsworn Vamper. And Champion of Dusk. Draw X cards and lose X life, where X is the number of vampers you control. Alright, Mystical Magical Pack, what have you for me? A 
All right, another Ceratops. Enter the Unknown, Swift Warden, and a Path of Discovery. It's kind of a cool card, a little bit clunky, but I'm going to sprinkle that into Explore. It's not necessarily the worst thing in the world. Especially if you're just kind of messing around a little bit from a competitive standpoint. I think it's just a little bit too slow. Maybe three mana you could pull that off. I'm not sure. I don't know. What do you think? Jungle Creeper, Woodland Stream, Pirate's Pillage, and... Hey, hey, hey. Remember this guy? If you haven't, check out this video. Cool Commander deck tech on this guy. Kumena, Tyrant of Arazka. Super cool, really fun deck to play with. Um, definitely check that out. And that is Mythic number four. We still got a large stack of cards over here yet. Plenty of room for rekindling. Plenty of room for jade lights. Don't see any reason why not. All right, Highland Lake. Needletooth Raptor. Forerunner of the Coalition. Blank card. And this is another good one. Journey to Eternity. Journey to Eternity. Dies, pops back. And Atzal Cave of Eternity. Turn a creature to the battlefield. Alright, next guy. What you got? Alright, another Pitiless Plunderer. Aquatic Incursion, Charging Tuscadon, and Form of the Dinosaur. Form of the Dinosaur enters the battlefield, your life total becomes 15. At the beginning of your upkeep, Form of the Dinosaur deals 15 damage to target creature and opponent controls, and that creature deals damage equal to its power to you. I have seen someone play this. I can't remember what the deck was. It was actually kind of a fun standard casual deck. Um, I might want to do something with that. I just think it'd be kind of fun um, just to kind of mess around with. Maybe come up with a clever little deck with that. Another Pitiless Plunder, Blazing Hope, or Oathsworn Vampire, and Radiant Destiny. I don't know if this is still worth anything, but I think it's kind of a cool card. Throw a little Vigilance on there with the Send. Definitely not a bad card. Alright, next one. Speed it up here a little bit. See red. Legion Lieutenant. Shake the foundations. And Kamena's Awakening. Come on, something good. Alright, Forerunner, Pillage, Crested Herd Caller, and another Mythic, Time Stream Navigator, Ascend, and some other fun little abilities. Well, we are definitely on the Mythic train, and there's no reason, in my opinion, it has to stop. There's not an official rule that says it does. Relentless Raptor, Forerunner, Swift Warden. And break into Mongo. Move some of these cards off to the side. We're piling up here. Another Forerunner. Strength of the Pack. Siren Reaver. And release to the wind. And it's gone. Alright, last of the stack. We've got one measly stack to go. Strength of the pack. Everdawn Champion. Oh, nice. Arch of Arazka. This is nice in some of those control and or delay decks. And a Sun Sentinel. 
foil foil. All right, final stack. Let's be a good one. Good. Let's get a Jade Light. He's still up there in price. He and or she. It. Them. See red. Uh, Zokin Seer. Spell from Arazka. And Mastermind's Acquisition. Nice little option card there. Next up, another Forerunner. Turn that into focus, hello. Forerunner, Slippery Scoundrel. Majestic Helioptorus. Oh, and a Silent Gravestone. Not sure what this one's worth. I guess uh, I'll let you know in the video, but anything that can stop graveyard play. Always a nasty little sideboard. Another Curious Obsession, Verdon Champion, Reaver Ambush, and Deep Root Elite. Sesame. Forerunner of the Empire, Sadistic Sky Marcher, Dire Fleet Neckbreaker. And a Paladin of Atonement. He's got to atone himself. Firebrand and a bunch of starter decks. There we got the Woodland Stream, Forerunner, Daring Buccaneer, and Protein Raider. Kind of a whatever card there. That's okay. No complaints about this box so far. Other than everything hasn't been a mythic. Brontodon. Dead Eye. And the Summoner. We're winding down here. Getting down to the Last of the Mohicans, as I like to say. Stone Quarry. Quarry? Quarry. Sprinter. Fadan. Oh, cool. Another legendary dragon. Glad they didn't bother to make these mythics. That would have been kind of lame. Tali Primal Storm. Cool commander card, maybe, maybe we'll see that in the future. Maybe, oh, maybe. All right, Flood, Stormfleet, Famished Paladin, and a Tender Shoot Dryad. Come on, Kindling. Alright, first uncommon, Highland Lake, Cherished Hatchling, Splendid Griffin, and nice, another good card, Wayward Sword Tooth, and the Sea Legs. Alright, looks like three left. If I cans do math. Heart of the Conquerors. Material flow. Mamma oh, mia, that's a oh, spicy oh, meatball. Oh, 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 yeah. Foil Jade Light Ranger. Sweet. And a path of metal. Put the path of metal there. Get rid of this junk and sweet. I'm not sure the value is honestly a lot more for the foil version. Just because I hate to say it, but it just doesn't pop the right way. But Either way, I asked for a Jade Light Ranger, and I got it. 
Um, still waiting on that Rekindling Phoenix, though. Why not get it in the last couple of packs? There's no reason we can't. Unless it's not there. That'd be a good reason. He's in hope. Ambush. Expel. Oh, and the Blood Sun. Dude, that's not Blood Moon. Yeah. Last one. Come on, Boomer Bust. have Ceratops, Merfolk Mistbinder, Shake the Foundations, and a Screech's Decree with a Foil Thunderherd Migration. Well, I don't know what the total is, at least at this point, but I mean, one Mythic, two Mythic, three, four, five, probably kind of a miss, pretty decent. Whatever, great and great. And then we sprinkle in some of these rares. Again, some misses, obviously. That's good. That's a bomb. Uh, that's good. Good. Um, that's a good one. Good, good. Do, 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 do. That's a good one. Another good one. Do, 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 do. What else do we got here? I thought we had another pretty decent one in here somewhere. Dire Fleet, Primal Tide, all good ones there. And then some foils to go with it. So I am pretty happy with that. I will definitely take it. So uh, again, if you like what you see, if you want to see more, feel free to share, subscribe, hit that like button. We really do appreciate it. And uh, yeah, should be in the bottom of your screen right now. Do, 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 do. Go ahead and click that, but until next time, this has been Booster Therapy.